And let's throw in and let's do another one, man. I feel like we're just starting to get the uh, we're just starting to get the the gist of it. Choose one companion to start with. I mean, there's no shot that I'm not starting with uh, with burnout. Let me take a look at him. He's got slap, lame exit. Will flee at the end of this turn. Refresh them. Somebody smarter than me, tell me what that means. Oh, you know what? You could spend two purples if you're in overflow for free, and then you, you, could, you could spend as many purples as you want. And then you do one attack at the end, but then he'll flip. Okay, I see. Okay. I mean C is what we used last time. Sure, let's let's throw C out here. I've chosen one companion. Alright, let's head out. Noak, you okay? You're trembling? Don't worry, don't worry about all this, okay? This is this is meta progression, also known as lore. Step one. Give me an item. Well, how, we got the flower too. Nine coins. I love it. I'm not going to kill a single fish. Like, who cares? Eight more coins. Now, some slightly stronger fish? Maybe, maybe. These are not stronger fish. Two fish are attacking. It is left and right fish. I'm going to perform a rough takedown. I'm going to perform a knuckle buster. As I was not refreshed, I will then simply... What do you do? Cries and produces a blue pigment. Okay, get slapped to minimize our overflow and give us more red pigment. I pass my turn. Then I send Burnout over to the side here. Have him do a Knuckle Buster and get smoked. Okay, don't even play the Final Fantasy VII theme for that. Like, we just... That's a gimme. We got 19 coins burning a hole in our pocket. We go again. I feel like you always go crazy ranking this guy up. Give him a chance. Start me off with a uh, bone bust. Oh, no, no, no. You can't do it that way. Swap you to the side. Rough takedown. Red pigment. Give me a, a bone buster, if you don't mind. Get killed. We did not get refreshed. What's your thing? Consume a pigment. Move to the left or right and apply a shield. I, also known as I sleep. How much damage does your... Roman decimation just kills you? In that case, get killed. Why does Chip have Pawn Crazy enabled? Chip is always looking for an excuse to play Mahjong. I feel like I don't need another party member just yet. You know what? Maybe maybe it's smart. Maybe let's go check out this guy again. Ugly. Are you talking to me? The fact you assumed I was talking to you says volumes about your self-esteem. Ugly, 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 ugly. Okay, so he won't join us. Fair enough. Understood. What about this freak? What a mess. Hey, the man turns from observing the impaled corpses. Oh, hi. He turns back. Noak, what are you doing? Asking this guy to join us. I don't trust anything about him. I don't trust you, dude. I, I still remember what happened at the end of the tutorial. I still think spike powers sound rad. Sigh. Let's go. Okay, he won't even let us meet him. All right. 
problematic. Let's fight a large man. Probably get a lot of uh, resources for this. You should move here. Smack him. Generate some red pigment. You got 19. You moved a little bit to the side. We hate to see that, but you know what? This does 12. This does 9. Okay, we'll start off with the 12. We did get refreshed, which basically means you're owned. I'm going to then move over here. I'll spend one red pigment to kill you. We've been refreshed again. We could attack nothing just to avoid... Um... Well, what are you doing? You're just making a shield? We could attack nothing to avoid burnout, but I want to keep my, my red pigment as much as possible. Now, literally, like, you're just dead. Like, how embarrassing is this for you? You really, like... Oh, never mind. I forgot how to do math. I forgot you had a shield. Either way, if you got burnout on your team, you actually can't lose. At least in the early game, he's, he's too strong. 20 currency. The heck is this guy? Seems like maybe we have a tough fight. So what I'm going to do is rank up Nowak. Is this Hickory? I think I went to the boss too early. <laughs> All right, solve, solve the puzzle, okay? Anyone got overexert? You're skittish, slippery, and multi-attack. You're skittish and multi-attack. Deals a painful amount of opposition of damage to the opposing party member and then moves them to the left or right. Inflicts two oil slick to the left and right party members. Okay, so we, we would love to not get hit by that and then get lit on fire. This seems sensible to me. I think we probably try to kill you first. And you're skittish. Skittish is after you perform an attack. We could just get a chain and get, like, insanely lucky. That's one strategy. I love how I, I looked at what I was going to do. Oh, you're slippery, too. And then I just did exactly the same thing I do every turn anyway. So you being skittish is actually more likely that we could get lucky and, and full combo you. You, on the other hand, are going to move after we hit you once. So I think we're, we're going to roll the dice here. Give me the 12 damage. Two-piece Marty. No refresh. Understandable. Have a good day. You're going to do nothing. You're then going to uh, apply oil to uh, Nowak. Then you're going to do some damage to Burnout. And then you're going to do no damage to anybody. Okay, that's not that bad. I feel like we can just leave it like this. Oh, you're right, he'll move before the oil. Because after he, after he hits nothing, he'll move to the right. And then he'll hit you. Because you would do it. There's a cleave, right? Yeah, so move you over here. And then you won't get... No one will get hit by the cleave, presumably. Let's see. Bash hits nothing. He moves to the right. Oil spill hits nothing! Greatest chat comment of all time. Couldn't really dodge the bash anyway. Okay, well, you got me on that one. That's a good one. We already got some solid pigment here. I do feel like Hans, it would be nice if you could get some blue pigment. We could generate that off a of Lucky. What about this one? It requires another blue. Oh, I got a different Hans setup than I thought. I don't have his other heal. I've, I've got the cleave heal. Do me a favor. Start by moving here. And then this is the classic get lucky strategy. 12 damage. If we refresh, he's dead. Oh, no. It's it's slightly less damage than I thought. What are you... Because you're, tw you're actually 8 damage now. You're 9. This guy's still going to die, though. It would be awesome to refresh here. Oh! Oh, you 
idiot! You fucking suck! I'm the best, man. I did it. Okay, and then you should definitely do your heal now that we got the power here. Now let's take a look here. That was insanely lucky. You are going to hurt and then move and then hurt. So if I could just not have anybody be here at the end of the turn, that we should be okay. So I think... I think we just... I honestly think we... Can't even do that one. Okay. I think we just waste some orbs and then move to the to the side to stay safe seems fantastic now why don't you move over here you're you're freaking crazy with it we refreshed again which is is nutty i have to move you over i'm going to I'm gonna smack you and hope you move to the right so we can hit you with the refresh ability. Love to see that. And then, so this is gonna do eight. This is gonna do five. Let's hit you with the one that does eight. Did not refresh. What's your move? So you're gonna, you're gonna drop some oil, then you're gonna move, then you're gonna attack. The attack does what? Left and right? No, to the opposed. Okay. I think I would love for uh, the flower to get hit with some oil and then not get killed. Just slap him. He doesn't die. He doesn't die. Oh, you're right. Actually, he might move to the side by after a slap and then we can kill him. Okay, that's, that's a better move. Better move. He moved to the wrong side, unfortunately. Now you're going to... Oh, if I just move over here now, it's over for you. You're gonna oil spill, and probably move to the left and then bash nothing. Love to see it. Now, would be sensible to heal first, but we don't have the right uh, we don't have the right orbs for it regardless, so I'll pay, I'll just I'll just kill him. Easiest boss of my life. Twenty-three currency. You've unlocked the immolated fairy. Did I progress to the second floor too early? Did I did I make a mistake in this uh, in this domain? Yes. Okay. I guess you should always do the boss like as late as possible. I'm ranking up burnout. He's he's too good. I'm I'm ranking you up just because you haven't been ranked up yet, and then I'll just keep moving. These guys, it seems like it's okay to fight these guys if you have good DPS. Our DPS is crazy. You should start by doing 8 damage. Wait, okay, sorry. I'm, I guess I'm going too fast for the game. You've generated some pigment. We're going to start with the 14 damage. I'd love the refresh here. That's not how it went down. So we really should have looked at attacks first. You're going to consume three pigments and heal an amount equal. You're going to decrease the health of all of our party members. You're going to consume three pigments. Well, you can't all consume three pigments, just FYI. Ten percent pain. Mm, I don't really like this. I think we'd be better off like with a slap. Or I, don't, I mean, we'd be better off spending the pigments so they don't heal. Maybe it doesn't matter too much. Maybe I'm I'm over focused. Not to mention you can't really move anyway. I think we I think we just passed turn on this one. I guess I should have moved out of the way of the bash. <laughs> I didn't even look at what this guy was doing. <laughs> Your maximum health has changed. Don't worry, it'll reset at the end of combat. Wonderful news. Okay. Um, 
get killed. You are also decreasing max health. Oh, they're all dead. That's right. I don't want to spend money. It disappoints me. I remember this guy, Bubble Guts. Pure transfusion slippery. Killing you would be... Oh, yeah, especially killing you before you become God. That would be, like, ideal for me, I think. Fourteen damage. That's perfect. This also kills this lad right here. Never mind. <laughs> only, only if he's the last one remaining. All right. Well, what are you doing? Deal an agonizing amount of damage to the opposing party member. Well, that's not ideal. <laughs> what are you doing? Increasing maximum health by two. Well. Let's send out a, a little heal. This guy can't move. Agonizing, yeah, it sounds like a lot. So I'm not, like, super stoked about that. Eight damage. It's, it's not as bad as I thought it would be. What are you doing this time? Moving to the left or right three times, then dealing painful amounts of damage. You are just decreasing max health. Okay, so we should just go Pog Sicko mode on you. We should try to get a kill if possible. Because we are it's going to be very tough to dodge the attack. This will deal 12 to 13 damage. This will deal 11, but it has a better chance of refreshing. I take those. Actually, 13 damage with a slap could have done the job. I slap you, you're gonna move. Can I, can I heal the unit to the left? I could. Add one frail to the enemy. I guess we probably should have done that first. <laughs> now that I think about it. Makes a lot of sense. Um, but I think you can't move like past this guy. So I think if we just, if we just send out a little heal here. And then move you to the side. You should be re reasonably safe. Okay, you did a little hot swap. I guess my skull has been cleaved in twain or something. Okay, we have been ruptured. In a few turns, though, it'll wear off. It would be nice to get a heal first. And then... get killed. Easy mode. In a few turns, you won't have max HP. The fight's already over. I mean, literally, all I do is click on burnout and go, you know, go to town, brother. He can't be stopped. Upon receiving direct damage, this party member will either receive full damage, no damage, or double damage. That's frightening. How about this bag of nacho cheese? There is a vile slurping and choking noise from inside the mangled Revola corpse. Let me try something. You step closer to the corpse. You knock near a sphincter-like borehole in the corpse. Is someone, is it someone new? Does it bring a promise of feast? It smells little of feast. When it smells of feast, it shall feast with the long liver. It will watch its allies die to smell of feast. It shall return. Okay. That's not a party member, unfortunately. Let's go. Uh, honestly, I feel like maybe we need some items. If we're not getting, uh, if we're not getting a party member just yet. Produces three fish upon taking any kind of damage. Deals one additional damage, direct damage to the opposing enemy upon this party member performing an action. Very small amount of damage, but it costs zero. It takes up an item slot, though. At the beginning of combat, reduce lucky pigment chance to 
Okay, so it keeps us from overflowing as much. Increase party member's max HP by 10. This party member now has Leaky as a passive. This party is party member is one level higher than they would be otherwise. It's destroyed at the end of combat. I, useful on a boss, maybe. Adds yellow essence to this party member as a passive. Essence allows Lucky Pigment to be toggled to other colors other than blue. You know what? Give me the fly paper. And then just put it on you. I could I could toggle that to red, maybe. I guess you should take the needle and we could just put that like on our healer. Then they could do like a slap that all, that does two damage or a heal that does one. Never seen this guy before. Oh, you're right. It makes more sense on um, Burnout because he attacks more often, possibly. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, there you go. And then the other one, I just feel like I don't want to use at all, quite frankly. Oh, I guess we can see the way they're lined up. So we might as well, like... I guess, can I rearrange them here? No? We always want Burnout. Burnout, I want you right here. I want I want you at least facing one of these guys. How's that? Actually, you know what I think we want? If I if I'm being smarter. I was in an active party. We want this guy in the middle looks like he bleeds red. So Noak attacks him. We put Burnout on the margins and put Hans in the middle to set up a heal. Hey! Okay, toggle this. It can only be blue or yellow. I mean, honestly, it's like I'd rather it be blue, I guess. Because <laughs> that helps our healer out. We get yellow very easily on this fight, but good to know. Oh, we, and we got one. Okay, now you, you can literally lethal somebody right off the jump. That's beautiful. You should definitely use a heal. Oh, you absorbed my pigment when you died, you piece of crap. You're gonna consume two non-yellow pigments. You're gonna consume three non-red pigments. You're the only one doing damage to the left and right. Okay, so useless. Um, and then you're just, I mean, I, it sounds crazy. We can't really heal. We should really just move you over here and have you issue a, a devastating slap to generate some red pigment for us. And you're probably gonna eat it anyway, but in principle, I think it's the right idea. Okay, quick little shuffle. We still have one red pigment. That is nice. Did you get, did you get, the, you did get decimation minus two there. Okay, how about you come over here then? Wait, well, he's got a gun. Deals an agonizing amount of damage to the left, opposing, and right. Okay, so you have to die. You deal damage to the left and right. But how much is it? It's merely painful. We gotta, we gotta kill the guy with 16 HP left first. Move me here. Take a smack. Lots of red pigment. Move me here. This kills you, and we get a refresh chance. We, we got refresh. Now, is there, you're skittish. Skittish is after you attack. And you attack the left and the right. It's not so bad. You, you can afford to take a little hit. Can I just heal you a bit? Nope, not at all. Well, you know what I can do? I can slap you and generate another yellow pigment. Okay, and turn. He took our red. He did it again. Um, one fire to all party members? No thanks. How about come over here and, and have your ability be performed? How am I gonna kill you though? I think I gotta, I gotta take some self damage. It's only 10%, it's not so bad.
You can't move after refresh if you already moved, unfortunately. It would be nice. But then Burnout would be the most OP unit of all time. Deal 5 damage to the opposing enemy upon this party member moving themselves to another position. It's insane. It seems unbelievable. Is it now is is purple the boss? <laughs> I don't want to make the same mistake I made last time. Purple is the boss. Okay, let's let's fight Defenso then. We're generating a lot of yellow. That's that's kind of unfortunate. You know what? It'd be nice to get some blue into the action economy here. How about one of these for eight. You're all you're all attacking. You're attacking left to right. You, we gotta take middle unit. No lucky. You then move here. You get killed by our ram. Now you are getting a. Do you attack left right too? You do attack left right. You piece of junk. You're gonna attack Hans. Be nice to generate some some blues. We don't even have any reds, though. How am I, how am I gonna make it through this? <laughs> um, we could just get lucky. 10% self damage. Used needle was used. Dude, that was the greatest play of all time. He's, his ability is used, unfortunately, but don't we have enough to do a heal now? Everybody's quite low on health how much you painful painful wait a second just let me think about this i don't want you to get hit you can slap oh you know what move burnout with hans You do a slap, because you don't have the, the orbs for anything else. That gets a kill. And then you're just hopefully not going to die, because if you die, my run is over. Ooh. <laughs> hmm. It would be nice to get a heal this turn. All you're doing is creating a shield. Okay, so we got like a bit of a freebie. Get hit. Generated some purple that we don't care about at all. You you do have a heal. You do, dry land is not a myth. I've seen it. We got another lucky that we don't really care about at all. Um, and you can't really do anything here. We're just going to pass turn. Plus three shield and then he immediately moved out of the way of it. You're just you're a, you're a pigment consumer. Pathetic. Honestly, I think that we should spend one yellow, do 10% self damage to get out a nice little heal here. It's not a ton, but it's something. Then you move over. Then we got to do 10% self damage just to hit you because I don't have two yellows anymore. What a waste, man. All right, I'll pass my turn. We don't have the right kind of mana. We're getting mana screwed. Go ahead, go ahead, eat my blues, eat my purple. See if I care. You should do your cleave heal. Twenty percent self damage, though. Oh, never mind. You should just get in a nice little smack here. Oh, but then you're attacking. You're, but you're attacking left and right. Well, someone's got to take a hit then. Let's let's make sure it's you. I guess I could just move you here instead and then have you use any ability. And you'll die. That was an, a very annoying fight. 
20 currency. No boss, please. Can I get another party member? I feel like I need I need more orb users. A bloated corpse buzzes with fries in front of you. The corpse? It's just the corpse. Have we seen anything else rot down here? So weird. Can we take it with us? Why not? Take a guess. Your first guess is correct. Come on, man! I need... I need a fourth party member. I got, you know, I got to fight a, a... I don't even want to know if this guy's going to have like a double entendre for a nose or something. 65 HP? Well, I feel like we just... We, we simply lose. But you are forgetful. Can't perform the same attack twice in a row. An agonizing amount of damage to the two opposing party members. Understood. You know what's nice about this, though, is you do generate some, some red pigment for us. So let me start with a... Um, I know it sounds crazy. I'm going to start with a slap to generate some red pigment. We even got a lucky one off that, didn't we? Maybe not. I don't know. I, then we can do total decimation just to do a bunch of damage. It refreshed us anyway. Let's follow that up with a total... Let's follow it up with the Throat Buster. We refreshed again. Holy cow. Let's follow that up with a total decimation. We have too much pigment. We're gonna overflow, man. Use Needle Use. Not refresh this time, but that was still like 40 damage in a single turn. That's still really good. Now, his ass has gotta move. And because you do so much damage, we're probably just going to focus on... Well, I think we should do some, like, nothing attacks. You're just... You're, you, these guys are eating my orbs! That's fine, dude! There's, there's nothing wrong with that at all! Move me? Ram you... Oh, I should have moved you here. <laughs> move me? And then, I mean, you might as well, I guess, do some attacks. Because even though we'll generate pigment, these guys are going to eat pigment anyway. Okay, sure. Uh, use Needle Floods you with Pigment. It makes sense. Okay, they've eaten some orbs. Big whoop. They've eaten some orbs. He's eating your points. Now what are you doing this time? You're flying up in the air? I'd rather kill you, if possible. But this guy is gonna light all enemies on fire. That's no good. First thing I'd like to do... Why don't you come over here? Do a quick throat buster on you. Use needles used. Gives us even more yellow pigment. I see the problem. You should then move over here, which should use ram and kill this guy. Beautiful. This guy's just applying a shield. So we should just... Uh, our next move should just be to attack you. Makes perfect sense. We should change that to blue. Should have done it earlier, but is what it is. Not really a great opportunity to heal anybody here. We could we could spend the yellow just to slap and then generate a blue. Okay. Oh! I did not see that coming. Okay. The man is shielded out of his gourd. This enemy forfeits his turn. That seems lovely. I wouldn't mind... I wouldn't mind punching you, even though you're in a shield right now. Let's punch you. Gave us a lot of purple. Let's use our ram. We got way too many orbs, dude. <laughs> we got we to gotta burn some orbs. Let's... I mean, if this guy's forfeiting his turn eight, what do you do? You're just adding a shield? You move here so that you can use your... Your heal on, on all of our units. There you go. Now we got some orb space remaining. And I feel like this turn, I don't want to generate any orbs, man. But I'm going to generate orbs no matter what. So, you know, we might as well do some attacks in the process. Let's try a quick little throat buster. Use needle was used. We're flooded to, to all hell, but so be it. One damage each. I can live with that. Vertigo. 
We gotta get these orbs out of here. You got six. You should, I mean, you're dead. You should move and then get throat busted. That doesn't do enough damage. I'm a fool. It does literally one too few, but that's okay, because watch this. A quick little move. I was then gonna slap you, but then I realized you got the shield. I'm a damn fool, dude! What is this? Three ruptured to all party members? Deals a little damage to all party members. Okay, hang on. We gotta maximize orb usage. You move here so that we can then get... You can't even really do the heal? What if we slap, we'll get more pigment. Okay. Perform this ability. He's dead. That's wonderful news. We're taking 14% self damage. Oh, I slapped, if I slapped him, he would have died. He would have taken double damage. You gotta do something, man. I'd rather you... I'd rather you get a heal out here and like take 20% self damage. Lower the damage that's going out to everybody at least by 4%. <laughs> we lost focus though, that sucks. All right, now it's over for you, dude. We should have killed you faster. I'm realizing that we are really struggling with overflow. You know what would help? Having a fourth party member. But unfortunately, every NPC you visit just like back talks you. Adds original sin as an additional ability. A powerful but limited healing ability. Hang on. Because use needle is, is done, man. Unequip all. I'd like to see your abilities then, if I if I may. Original sin. Heal this party member two health. Refresh this party member's abilities. 25% chance to curse this party member. Deals two damage to this party member if cursed. Hang on. Seems great. I don't know if it should be on you necessarily, but it seems great. Curse blocks healing. Still 25%? I feel like on you to, to force your refresh. Then Ram was fine on you. You moved to position yourself for a heal anyway. And then of the remaining ones, I'm sorry to say that I still think Flypaper might be the best. We've only got two options, man. Okay, give me, give me a rank up on you. And then give me the combat, but I'm scared. I'm scared. And then we definitely want you and you here, and then you should be in a position where there's no enemies, so that we can easily, like, ram you into one. Okay. It's my turn. These guys have overexert. I remember that. So get smacked. Lovely. thinking okay you're slippery is that whenever you take damage or is it whenever you direct damage and what's your overexert six okay well let's try this they okay they moved again but now i gotta move your ass you're the one okay and you're just doing what are you doing spawns a random small enemy big whoop we sleep on that step one I guess if we we can't do original sin after we miss on a refresh. You have to do original sin first. We might as well might as well start with it for one yellow. At least it eats an orb too. We're not cursed and we're refreshed, which which means we could just run that right back. <laughs> Beautiful. Send it. You love to see that. And then, might as well catch you with a total decimation. We're refreshed again. That's that's Pog crazy with it. 
but like we can't do anything. And every time we use it, we generate a yellow pigment anyway. Well, you might as well, honestly, I don't, I think, I think you could afford to burn reds. Crazy as it sounds, I think you can afford the, to, oh, you know what, no, 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 hot swap him, you're absolutely right. Then give him, uh, give him another total decimate. Actually, this time you could get by with just a throat buster. I'm refreshed again. <laughs> I got too many orbs. Okay, burn some orbs. And burns, they, they don't burn. I, I, I'm clearly misunderstanding like a basic mechanic here. I love our orb assessment, or our orb uh, selection here though. Bunch of question marks. Must be due to you. I'm not worried about that because we can kill these guys this turn. So, like, get smoked. You're dead. We're orbing out of our gourd. We're generating... You know what? I know what it is. You need to generate blues. That's the problem. Yeah, blue... Is it the same on everyone? It is. Okay. Hmm. <clears throat> This may not kill you. I'm not worried about this guy. I'm worried about making sure we hit overexerts on these guys. You know what? I'm like, step one, maybe I, no, 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 no. Don't be stupid. Step one, use your ram. Our pigment's going nuts. Then, I'd like to move it, move it, and and do a... We'll start with the Throat Buster because of the higher refresh chance. It worked. You moved in, you did not move in the direction I wanted you to move, which is very upsetting for me. If you had moved this way, then I could have hot swapped you and we would have been chilling. But now I'm gonna, I mean, just throw a slap out there. You haven't done a move yet. You throw a slap, oh, but the slap's gonna give us a red pigment. It's okay, I guess it could be worse. Pass turn. You've regurgitated. You've created another small enemy. We're now, we're now in, it's heavy orb zone. We're not using enough orbs. Start me with this. Very strong chance it gets a kill. Guaranteed chance it gets a kill. We're too orbed up. We got too many orbs, man. Move me here. Perform an ability. I, I can't burn orbs fast enough. Every time I attack an enemy, I just... It's just not good. Let's put it that way. I'll move you here. Oh, look, I, the orbs, they never cease. I need more lads. People are like, attack nothing to drain pigment. That's what I'm doing, but all I can do is like a, a simple slap. All I can do is a simple slap. Okay, you are now coated in oil. He's dead. Oh, he left. That's amazing. We're gonna be fine. You go here. You go here. Excuse me, you go here. And just execute. Okay. This actually didn't go that badly. They're gonna force us to fight the boss though. Yeah, all right. Well, this seems, this seems pretty bad. <laughs> Just a guy in a sack. Uh, the smooth skin. All right. Let's see what we got going on here. Deals an agonizing amount of damage to the direct opposition enemy. Slightly heals the opposing party member but makes them frail. Deals a painful amount of damage to the left and right. Molds the clay, shields all enemies' location, creates two visage, deals a painful amount of indirect damage to this enemy. How about, like, you got some passives here? 
infantile. If you hit this enemy, any parental enemies will perform an action in retribution. Are not, oh, you guys aren't parental yet, though, okay? You're an inanimate object. You're forgetful. You're withering. Well, there's no, there's no parental enemies yet. So I feel like on turn one, you gotta go... Well, but then he's gonna spit out so many purples, which is just like a slap in the face. Start me is a bit of a bold move. Start me right here. Use a ram, generate some red pigment. Then, you're not on full HP, so let's start with original sin. I've become cursed. Okay, so we're not gonna um, do use original sin anymore. <laughs> we'll do 14 damage to you. That gives us some blues. Now, I was just gonna say, you. I know you can do some stuff with some blues, okay. You should. What? It, what is your move? Right, you deal an agonizing amount of damage right in front of you. Okay, so I'm actually not going to move you in for the heal. What I will do is use a heal just to heal ourselves and use some orbs. Smart, I think. Then why don't you move over, perform your brutal takedown. We're focused, moisturized, unbothered. Okay, he misses. Oh, he moved, which means that you will get hit. What? No, no, he hits himself, I remember. He hits himself, and now you got red HP, okay. Sibling's visage, father's visage. So you must be parental, but you don't have the effect of parental. Oh no, I did not see Dan's chain restaurant tier list. I would love to know though. <laughs> so what do you do? You, you have a gun. Inflicts curse to the opposing party member. Consumes up to 10 pigment and then obliterates itself. I gotta know what Dan's S-tier chain restaurants are. Little Caesars! Dan has, like, listen. He has too much Michigan pride. And in a way, like, it's endearing. But, like, when it comes to pizza and automobiles, you gotta let... You gotta let Michigan go a little bit. Except, actually, Detroit-style pizza is really good, but Little Caesars isn't it. That's like me being from Vancouver and being like, oh, I love Earl's. I know a lot of people talk shit about Earl's, but Earl's is actually, like, an amazing restaurant. He has Pizza Hut in the top tier. Listen, like I like Pizza Hut, but that is, it's a bit psychotic. I'm setting up a turn here. First, I'm gonna smack you. You have been killed. Oh, because we're focused, we do more damage. Is Sparrow in the S tier? It's a little, it's a little much. <laughs> now, what are you doing? You're just hurting yourself twice, but creating a few enemies. Okay, well then I'll just move you here, so that I do some damage. I mean, am I really gonna slap you and flood myself with, with yellow? I don't think so. I guess I'll just pass my turn. My man is molding the clay. Oh, 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 my own visage. The heck is going on, man? <laughs> it's too much. <laughs> Who's the worst here? The, the siblings' visages are very rough. Applies one shield to all possible enemy positions and then obliterates this visage. This one, I, I have no problem letting this live. 
The father visages, it would be nice if they if they died too. I think first things first. I mean, you gotta go. I almost feel like maybe you just move. Smack. We're gonna be flooded with yellow here for sure. Dude, being f focused is so good. Wait, you're pure. What the heck did pure do again? Enemy's health color. Oh, right. Okay. So it was like a failed trigger. I don't really want to kill you. I I would much rather have the the this father's visage be killed. It would have to be like this. Refresh me. Well, we could always hot swap you. Oh, but then this guy's taking a bunch of damage. That's the end of my turn, right? No, you, have, you haven't performed an action yet. We could heal you slightly. That's, that's something. I'll give you a little heal. Oh, it, oh, cursed means you can't heal. Oh, no. <laughs> Burnout. I think we're losing this one. Play has been molded. He doesn't do enough damage to himself every turn. That's that's my problem right now. Okay, like you still gotta go, and at least we're standing in the apt position for this this time. We did not become refreshed. Life is is pain. Um, we're we're gonna have so many orbs, dude. Am I, am I crazy to think that we got screwed by never getting another party member? Father attacks left and right. Mother attacks left. No, you're... Who are you? <laughs> That's you. You attack. Oh, so you're going to frail uh, burnout, which is okay, because he's basically one-tapped anyway. The heal's not going to work, but that's fine. You skipped all the party members on the first floor? Yeah, and then on the second floor, I went to every single one of them, and they just told me to go suck my own dick. You attack left and right. You attack... Okay, so you should move here. We're going to smack you. It's going to use two orbs. It's going to generate two orbs. That means we lose focus, which is unfortunate. There's still a chance, but it requires us to become the luckiest person of all time. Actually, there's no chance. Because I have to kill all the parental units. Otherwise, if I attack you, then they get retribution. Can you please just do a heal? You don't have, we don't have the two blues. Come on, man. Use a purple and a purple and a red. Oh, but you can't heal this guy anyway. There's no there's no point. They aren't parental. It's, it's his father, mother. Apply too frail to the opposing enemy. Have they attacked? I've never attacked the the, the base guy because they're because I'm worried about them attacking me. They're not the real parents. Well, you know what? Let's put it to the test. Oh, maybe you're right. Although that's direct. That's indirect damage. Well, let's, let's follow it up with a slap in that case. Oh, yeah. We should have been going crazy on this guy. Minus two. Minus four. I think we need to go for broke, man. Orbs, though? Well, like, we're, we're kind of... This is like our... We're, we're pushing our chips all in anyway. It's like no matter... If, if we spend the orbs, they always give us orbs. So there's nothing we could do about that. If we don't spend the orbs, we just generate more orbs anyway. I think we might just be dead dead, though. 
Hmm? Burnout, not a surprise. But it's going to be really hard to kill the boss without having burnout. Listen, I'm willing to chalk this one up to like a language um, issue. That's my mistake for assuming that mother and father um, were parental. Give me a quick smack here. That's why you should never assume anything. I mean, I would just like to resign, essentially. I don't, I don't think we're making it out of this. I gotta be honest, that, that was the first thing I've had in the game so far that made me a little annoyed. Admittedly, it was my own assumption, and I, I, I take responsibility for that. Kind of took the wind out of my sails, though. I can't, there's nothing, there's nothing I could do. I, I can smack you. Could you just kill me? I'm just begging you to kill me. Okay, appreciate it. Come on, you didn't have to go and die. I feel like I didn't have much of a choice there. When you originally said they didn't have the traits, people in chat were saying to read their names, so... Yeah, I mean, that's... A, you gotta recognize... The trick for backseating is to trust the right backseaters. When I said they didn't have the parental trait, there were people that were saying, look at their names, bro, I can't. Which you never do. There's no way to, cause some, you know, the, the most prolific backseaters, with the exception of Fallen Flame, are the ones that are the least trustworthy. People will show up, I, you can look at their chat logs, like in, in reverse chronological order. Well, I, in chronological order, I guess. Their first message is like, I just showed up and I have no idea what's going on in this game. Their third message is like, here's how you win. Like, it's, it's psychotic the amount of confidence these people have online. Anyway, is Counter-Strike 2 out yet? I'll slash marker that as brutal orchestra.